And following 9-11's attack, our border was also affected as law enforcement agencies increased security. Fox 39's Alejandra Guzman reports. Flags flying at half staff, organizations, families, and friends gathering remembering what marks the 14th anniversary of the 9-11 attack. For many across the country, it's a day of remembrance, a tradition of honoring the more than 3,000 lives lost. Local officials say it wasn't just the heroic deeds that those in uniforms made, but also the citizens that rose up in the face of danger, helping complete strangers. From the Sikh taxi drivers who basically were giving free rides to find people's loved ones in New York City that day, uh, to the people who were on the airplane finding the terrorists to prevent them from crashing into the White House or the Capitol. All these things are heroic deeds that basically redefine who we are as Americans. Webb County Sheriff explaining 9-11 affected many countries as lives of many nationalities were lost during the attack, pointing out the U.S. might have been attacked at a time when our country was vulnerable, but emphasized we learned from it. Now we, we're stronger because of, of how we share information now, how we you know, talk to each other you know, as far as you know, any type of uh, information that might hurt the United States of America. Since then, many changes have occurred in our border. The Homeland Security Department was created in 2002, harboring 20 agencies. Inspections at the international bridges have increased their security measures, and new requirements have been implemented to travel in and out of the country. Now our law enforcement agencies work together. Lessons learned from this for, for us as first responders is that we rely more on one another we meet often with different organizations. Communication is the best tool that we have. Some may want to skip this day in its entirety, but terroristic threats do not rest, causing us to be alert at all times. But there's no doubt these heroic acts will never be forgotten. Alejandra Guzman, Fox 39.